Hey guys, welcome to Retro Crisis. In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can add background music to your RetroArch menu. So the first thing you need to do is open RetroArch and go to main menu, then go to online updater, and then go all the way down to update assets, and then press enter to begin downloading. Once the download has finished, you can shut down RetroArch and go to your RetroArch folder. And then once you're in your RetroArch folder, you need to find a folder called Assets, which is this one here. And then open it, and then go to the Sounds folder. And then once you're in the Sounds folder, you need to find bgm.ogg, which is the first file here. Now this is the file that will be selected as the background music within your RetroArch menu. So what we're going to do is delete the two bgm files, so you can either delete them or store them elsewhere, but for now I'm just going to delete them. And what I'm going to do is bring in my own BGM file, which is this one here. Now the problem is this is an MP3 file and we want to save it as a .ogg file. So what you'll need to do is convert the MP3 to .ogg. So I don't know of any apps that can do this. I'm sure you can recommend some, but if you go to Google and do a quick search of MP3 to OGG, there are a number of websites that should be able to help you with that. And then once you've got your OGG file, you just need to copy and paste it into the sounds folder. So now I'm going to delete my original MP3 file and I'm left with the .ogg file. Now go back to RetroArch. So once you're back in RetroArch, go to settings, audio, and menu sounds. Go to mixer and switch that on. Excellent. And now all you need to do is go down to enable BGM sound and that will reference the bgm.ogg file we just copy and pasted and then switch it on. And you should begin to hear your background music begin playing. And if the music gets too annoying, you can also switch it off. Now going back to the sounds folder, you can technically customize pretty much every one of these sounds and add something custom to your own liking and preferences. Anyway, I hope you found this video useful. This has been Retro Crisis. Thank you for watching.